Hello and welcome. My name is Francisco Antoategui, otherwise known as Kiko. I'm a customer adoption manager for QuickBase. I'm very excited to be here to show you a little bit about Lucid and how to integrate with QuickBase. Uh, for those of you unfamiliar with LucidChart, LucidChart is a platform where you can draw out and customize your workflow processes and start the app planning process and even start building your table-to-table -table relationships. And that is essentially what will integrate over to QuickBase. So starting out, you can see I'm here in my home screen. To start with a new blank canvas, you wanna click new, LucidChart and blank. And what that's gonna do is gonna open a blank sheet. And this is where you can start planning out and visualizing how your workflow processes work. I would always recommend going in here and clicking around. It's a fairly simple tool to use. You can see here on the left, I have my flow charts, my shapes up top, the customizable bar. And right here is where we're actually going to connect uh, a line to table to tables or from shape to shape, however you see fit. Now, in order to integrate into QuickBase, there's a specific shape you need in order to create table to table relationships and tables that are going to be compatible with QuickBase. In order to find that, you click here on shapes. And you scroll down and you find the one that says entity relationships. These right now are the only ones compatible with QuickBase. So we're going to go ahead and click that, say use selected shape. And it's going to be the third one in that is able to be used. And you can see that right there is a replica of what a table looks like in QuickBase. I'm going to grab two just to show you. Right here is where you Put in the title of the table. Right here is the field and the field type. We're going to want a text there. Now, most field types are going to be similar to QuickBase, but there are either a three letter code you could use or spelling out the full name. And some are going to be a little different, but I do have a help document to show you at the end that will list all of the fields and their field types. In order to create a relationship between these two tables, we're going to want to select the one with the little crow's feet right here. Once we select that, in order to create a relationship, we can highlight over one of the tables and that little red ball that appears, you click and drag and connect. So what this shows, this line shows that one has many of something. So customers will have many, we can title this orders. And it is that simple to create a one-to-many relationship. Now, for the sake of time, I've already gone ahead and created a whole example of tables and relationships built out that can integrate into QuickBase. I use an example of a bakery where customers have many orders, orders have many order items, products have many order items, and products have many products in. In order to export into QuickBase, it's very simple. We're going to scroll over here to the left, click Export. And which system are we using? We are using QuickBase. And down below, it's gonna give us our JSON language. What we wanna do is copy to a clipboard, head over to our builder account. We're gonna click create a new app. And you can see here at the bottom, LucidChart appears. And we want to create a new app using LucidChart. We're gonna click get started. And it says paste the commands from JSON language right here in the black box. We're gonna click in right click and paste. You can see all that language came over with the title of my application and some of my tables are listed right here, customers with all their fields. All looks good. We're just simply gonna click create app and it's that simple. Everything has been brought over and just to ensure everything was brought over smoothly, we can go ahead and go to our settings, our app management and show relationship diagram. And you will see that all of my relationships were created as I wanted them to. We can reorder this and all of them have their fields as it's 12 fields, 15 fields, and everything was brought over correctly. It's that simple. Now we do have a help document that I mentioned before that you can find. You click the little help question mark, type in LucidChart, go, and it will be the first one, creating an app from LucidChart. Here, creating that for chart lists all the steps needed in order to integrate from LucidChart to QuickBase, limitations, and here are those fields I mentioned. 
you can use two letters and some of them will have three letters instead of typing out the entire field type within the box. And it is that simple. I hope this was helpful and thanks for joining me.